MindLab's E-Track is the most advanced coin relic and treasure hunting detector ever created. It features MindLab's FBS technology, which delivers 28 frequencies, offering you not only better depth on large targets and better sensitivity on smaller targets, FBS also gives you the ability to work in harsh ground conditions, including salt, and still have clear, precise target ID and discrimination, which means the A-Track finds more treasure and less trash. Let's take a look at the E-Track control panel. This is the power button. It turns the E-Track on and off. If you hold the power button down for three seconds, it also resets the detector to the factory presets. The backlight button turns the display backlight on and off. The backlight makes the display easier to see in low light conditions. Running your detector with the backlight off as much as possible will extend your battery life. Left and right shift buttons are used in the advanced editing functions. You'll become more familiar with these options after you learn the basics of the E-Track. The navigation buttons are used for adjusting settings in the detect screens. They're also used to navigate around the settings within the menu. The menu button is used to access the main menu at any time while the detector is turned on. The menu allows you to adjust all the basic and advanced settings of the E-Track. The pinpoint button turns the pinpoint function on and off. Knowing exactly where the target is helps you dig less and recover targets faster. The detect button is used to switch between the detection and digital screen displays. It's also used to return the E-Track to the main detecting mode from anywhere within the menu system. The Quick Mask button switches the display between Quick Mask and the main detect screen. Pressing the Accept Reject button just after passing the E-Track over a target will either accept or reject that target. The Noise Cancel button starts the Noise Cancel scan, so the E-Track can find the quietest of 11 different operating channels. Now that you're familiar with the control panel, let's take a look at the Quick Start. The E-Track is so advanced that to get up and running, you turn it on, press the noise cancel button and this starts the machine running through 11 different channels to find the lowest level of electromagnetic interference. That interference can be caused by other detectors, power lines, things like that. Once the machine has gone through the noise canceling, it will select a channel and it will give you a tone to let you know that it's found the right channel. Press the detect button and go hunt. That's it. That's all there is to do. Now, let's go detecting. 